What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Grind Entertainment Channel. It's your boy Nako. Today I'm reacting to With or Without You by Dro Kenji. We've been waiting on this album for a minute now, man. It's just like December of 2021, man. I think I'm not, I don't even remember. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know our next video. And let's get into the album. The first song we got on here is Push to Start. A lot of these song titles I know because they was like popular, like Push to Start, uh, Bottle for Bottle. Excuse me. Uh, I feel like I've heard used to know, like not the song y'all know, y'all niggas know what I mean. The title, uh, autopilot. Those those names are familiar. The rest of these names I ain't never heard though. Like uh, I'm pretty sure he done made snippets for all those those songs that I just named. But uh, let's let's get into push to start though. Uh, So far, this song, this song is this song is fire, but like it's not what I expected it to sound like. Like, um, this stupid fucking paper man. I'm trying to get a paper so like I can rank my favorite songs on that album for when um for while I'm listening to it, or else I'm gonna fucking forget. All right, all right, I got some paper. I got some paper. But uh, the song is like, it's not how I expected it to sound. The shit's fire. It's still fire. But I was like, what was I? I was expecting to hear like some motherfucking. I don't, I don't even know, bro. I don't know how to explain it, man. But this shit is like, it's like a little, it's a little slow. It's more slow, it's more slow paced compared to what I was expecting. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if y'all niggas know what I'm saying, bro. But let me get back to the song. That was my favorite part right there, but that part right there goes dumb. That was push to start. That song was fire. The songs on this album that we done heard already, Vanish and Finders Keeper, I reacted to both of those songs already. If y'all want to see my reaction to them, go check them out. The individual videos are up on the channel. But uh, how do I want to rank those songs? As of right now, 
I'm trying to think, bro. What do I like push to start or vanish more? I don't I don't know. I think I like vanish more than push to start. So I'm gonna put vanish at number one. And then push to start at number two. And then Farnish Keepers is number three right now. But let's get on to the rest of the album. The next song we got to listen to is Tightrope. Since it's what you cook. I know that sometimes you feel like you're walking on a fucking tyro. I don't know how she got so untitled without a title. This right here, this is my favorite song so far. I know, I know, I'm, I know we barely heard any songs on the album. There's 15 songs on the album, and we only done heard three plus the one I'm listening to right now, bro. But as of right now, this is Tightrope is my favorite song off the album. This shit right here is slapping. fan on i don't know if y'all heard that shit in the background man but like my bad i kind of forgot to cut it off and i wasn't thinking until uh until i finished the song man so my bad on that one but anyways uh, we got tightrope we got tightrope right at number one right now that's my favorite song off the album right now tightrope and then we got vanish at number two push to start at number three and finders keepers at number four. And uh, if y'all are wondering why I got finders keepers at number four, I just it's down there because the majority of the song was scory and scory went dumb and all. But like, I'm not gonna cap y'all, man. I was there for Joe Kenji, <laughs> and that ain't no hate to scory, man. Scory is fire. I actually reacted to one of scory songs, uh, Die Young, but like it got blocked, so I couldn't upload it. But uh. Nothing against him, but I was just there for Dre Kenji. That's why that's why I said number four. But uh on to the next song. We got Bottle for Bottle. This shit already sounded amazing. We can go bottle for bottle. You get me drunk in the liquor. Off of the drugs, I still balling these niggas like Jordan and Pippin. But Lincoln, her drink, she in love with my pimpin'. Come down on my world, fall in love with my rhythm. Off of the drugs, I think about you. Oh, hey, it's me again. I'm high on my mind. I be replacing her with all the drugs that I take. Say, getting me out of my body. She only be stuck in my head. I think about you all the time. My ex bitch a thought she a humper. I'll pop out the cup with this big 40 bumper. I catch me an op, heat them up like the motherfucking summer. Yo, bitch fell in love with a bummer. I run to the bank like a motherfucking Olympic runner. These diamonds on me some stunners. I really be stunning. Think of you, how you think of me? I got it. Uh -huh. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. This shit right here. This one is immaculate. The vibes are immaculate. I'm really fucking with this one. This shit right here, man. That, that. Yeah, 
the beat selection, the choice the, for the beat, the flow, harmonies, all of that shit, bro. This shit is just immaculate from top to bottom. This right here. I don't know how many times my number one is going to change when I'm listening to this album, man. But this one right here is number one now. This shit goes down. You know I would never lie. Listen to that shit, bro. Listen to the, the serenation. This nigga. Oh, my God. We can go bottle for bottle. You get me drunk in the liquor. Off of the drugs. I'm still balling these niggas like Jordan and Pippin. Hey, it's me again. I'm high on my mind. I be replacing her with all the drugs that I take. Say, getting me out of my body. She only be stuck in my head. I think about you all the time. My ex bitch, I thought she a humper. I'll pop out the cup with this big 40 bumper. Listen to me. I just want you here by my side. Bottle for bottle, you get me drunk in the liquor. Off of the drugs, I still balling these niggas like Jordan and Pippin. We linking her drink, she in love with my pimpin'. Come down on my world, fall in love with my rhythm. Off of the drugs, I think about you. Oh, you only be stuck in my head. I think about you all the time. My ex bitch, I thought she a humper. I'll pop out the cup with this big 40 bumper. That one, none but a vibe, bro. That one, none but a vibe right there. That one most definitely got the number one spot. I'm just going to write B for B. And then we got Tightrope. Vanish. Push to start. I'm just going to write P2S. And then Finders Keepers. Finders Keepers. Alright, all right. what's the next song? The next song we got is Need You Right Now. It's by Joe Kenji and Highway. I don't know if Highway is like a music producer or if uh, he's like going to actually be rapping. I, I don't know how to, what's the deal with that, but uh, let's check it out. John. I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all. I'm going to do fake reactions around here. I'm not feeling highway part. I don't want to say it's bad. I just don't know what this nigga's saying right now. But uh, let me let me keep listening to it. It might grow on me. I just feel like the voicing ain't mixing well with the beat, man. It just don't sound right, if y'all get what I'm saying, bro. I'm not trying to hate on, bro. He he, he in a better position than me, man. But uh, you know what I'm... Y'all get what I'm saying, bro. Okay. The flow right there wasn't bad. I, I kind of like that part. That part right there was a, it was, it was good. It was good. It's growing on me a little bit. I can't even lie. It, it's growing on me a little bit. It's like. It's progressing slowly and slowly and slowly, but you know it's growing, it's growing on me. Pause, pause. I 
Is it me, bro? Or like this song don't sound like it's mixed right, bro? Like, am I tweaking? It just it don't sound like it's mixed all the way. It don't sound like it's mixed and master, bro. It do, but not like not a complete product, you know. But let me let me do this. I swear to y'all, bro. I'm not hating this song. It's st it's still not bad. It's not even bad, bro. But this this song most definitely is last right now. It's gonna go below Finders Keepers. But this song is not bad by any means. As far as I'm concerned, Joe Kenji still has not missed. Okay, that was Need You Right Now by Joe Kenji and Highway. That song, it grew on me towards the middle. It was, when it first started, I was like, nah, this not sounding right. It don't sound mixed and mastered all the way through. And I wasn't fucking with Highway voice like that. But uh, as time went on, it kind of, it grew on me. His voice just... I don't know. I don't know what's up with that, bro. It just it just got better halfway through. It just started sounding good. Maybe I just had to listen to it for a minute, get used to it. You know, I don't know. But besides that, it was a good song. Uh, but it's it's going sorry, but it's going to the bottom of my list under the finest keepers. And not to mention that the majority of the song was uh what it was. The majority of the song was highway. Like I said, with Finders Keepers, Highway had the hook and a verse, so like he dominated the uh, the time. I don't want to say time of possession, bro. This ain't football, man. But like, yeah, I'll get what I'm saying, bro. He dominated the amount of time that both artists had on the song, bro. But on to the next song, we got Disaster. Ooh. This shit right here, bro. This is like the flow go along with the title. Y'all get what I'm saying? Like this is how I would expect this song to sound. Like how I was talking earlier with push to start. How I was how I, how I was expecting it to sound versus how it did sound. This is more along the lines of how I thought push to start was gonna sound like. Push it starts sound like some fancy shit, bro. Like just I'm in my bag type shit. Like high not high pace, fast pace type shit. You know what I'm saying? But like But like I just it just didn't sound how I thought it was gonna sound. It still slapped though, but uh disaster sound exactly how I would expect it to sound. I would probably put this like 
I don't know, man. It's either one or two, bro. I don't wanna. I don't wanna put it above bottle for bottle because bottle for bottle, bottle went stupid. But uh, let me let me finish the song before I make my decision, though. Let's make a disaster and throw it all away and watch the world burn. Shorty say I'm so damn silent in person. I'm just thinking about all these bands. When I'm all alone, it's just me by myself. You is not by my side. What the fuck is a handout? Bitch, I do what I want. You're not changing me. I dropped 20 on diamonds for clarity. I left Mary to go fuck on charity. Cold and nigga, and ain't no declaring me. And the seven six two for his my life. Let me not, let me take that back. This. When I first read the title, I can't lie. I was expecting like some screaming type shit, like some X timing or some fucking syphilis juice world type shit, you know, bro. But that's only because the name is disaster. Like I was thinking, like, oh, it's a disaster type shit, you know. But this would be my next guest if y'all, my next guest if y'all get what I'm saying. Alright, that was disaster. I need to slide back into the camera view, man. Alright, alright, so what do I want to put that at? Yeah, I'm going to tie it. Bottle for bottle, disaster, both top for number one right now. I'll re I'm probably gonna re listen to both of them at the end and then uh do a tiebreaker or something. I don't know, bro. But um the next song we got is Used to Know. I'm a retard, bro. I was clicking on the wrong song. Yeah, I, I, I heard the snippet for this one. I remember this one, bro. I remember this one. I know that snippet was going stupid too. So let's see, let's see where this line on the list. From your worst nightmares. Let me let me let me say it real right quick since I know we ain't going to come back to it since that was a verse, bro. But that was my favorite part right there, bro. I gotta go back and hear that again. Right lie. That right here, bro. That's my favorite part. Nightmares. Nightmares.
That was used to know. That's most definitely number two. Hold on. I don't want to say it's most definitely number two. It's either three or two. No, no, no. It's three. It'll be three after the tiebreaker, bro. Right now, it's two. It's below bottle for bottle and disaster. Like, right there beneath them. Those two are tied for number one. Once I do the tiebreaker, it's going gonna, it's gonna to drop down to three, you know. But, like, we'll see, bro. We'll see, bro. But, like, I'm putting it at two now, right for right now. Okay. For the next song, we got Finders Keepers. Like I said earlier with Vanish, I already heard Finders Keepers. If y'all want to see me react to that, um, the individual reaction video is up on the channel. Go check it out. But uh, for the next song, we got Prison in My Head. This nigga Joey keeps this album. This shit is getting better progressively on as it goes on, bro. Like, which I believe it how is how it should be. But like, I just wasn't expecting it to keep songs keep replacing one and two over and over, bro. I just I just didn't expect it to be like that. But uh, let's get back to it. Since it's what you cook. Heart still don't work sometimes. Chest still heavier and feel inside. Whoa, huh? Hey, baby, read it to my mind. I would keep you all forever. Only if you care for mine. Deep inside my head, but I just learned to say I'm fine. I just Oh nah. Nah. This one. This one. Oh my god. I don't even know what to do, bro. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Do I dare put this shit at number one, bro? Should I do it? Like, I, I don't know what to do. Just off that harmony, bro. Can I do that? Like, damn. These niggas going stupid on this song, bro. This was number one, bro. This was number one. I'm sorry, but this was number one, bro. This shit is going stupid. I didn't, I didn't think, I didn't think it was gonna get better than Disaster and uh, Bottle for. Ooh, my voice is cracked. I didn't think it was gonna get better than Disaster. You should know on Bottle for Bottle. I didn't think it was. I was like, those are gonna be the top three songs. There's nothing that's gonna break that pinnacle. This shit right here is going dumb, bro. I wasn't expecting this. I was, I like. Listening to these other songs on this album, I was not expecting to get this type of song right here. Like, it's just, oh my god, bro, this shit is so fucking good, bro. Let me listen. Let me start by listening, bro. Most definitely, without a doubt, number one. Prison in my head. Most definitely, number one. Alright, that was Prison in my head, bro. That was, without a doubt, my favorite song off this whole entire album so far. Those, the, the fucking harmony of flows, that shit was just all so perfect. That shit just, it all came together. And it just hit it. The, I want to say it hit it at the right time. Like, What's the word I'm looking for? Everything was just on key. Everything was just on point. It was just what I was looking for at the time, bro. I, I, I don't really know. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. I don't know, bro, but that shit just, that, that's my favorite song, man. 
But the next song we got is See My Reason. And we gon' flex, you love my songs, I get this money real fast Yeah, this that young rasta lifestyle, I could not crash The only thing I ever knew is always stab your cash And always watch who you call gang, cause they gon' stab your No, bro, this nigga is getting better He's getting better as the album goes on, bro It's getting even better Like, I don't think this one's gonna be better than Prison in My Head But, like, you can hear it, bro Like, I can hear it in the flow Like, the way he's just sound I can hear it, it's just these these last couple of songs are just gonna be my favorite songs, bro. I can hear it. I don't know how many times I just said I can hear it, bro. But it was it was a lie. I knew it was. <laughs> That's the best part right there, bro. That is the best part, man. This song, oh, this nigga Joe Kitchy did his thing with this album. He did his thing, man. He did his thing. Damn, I just went back. He did his thing with this album, bro. Like, oh, do I dare say this is my favorite Joe Kenji album? I don't know, bro. That's a debate for a different day, man. That's a debate for a different day. I don't know how many uh subscribers or new viewers or whatever I'm gonna get off this album reaction, man. But like, for instance, if I get a good bit, bro, and y'all want me to put a poll up or anything like that, you know, like uh rank the albums, man, y'all drop it down below in the comments. I'll be more than happy to do that, bro. Cause I kind of want I want to know what y'all think. Like, what what do y'all think is the best song in this album, and what is y'all favorite Joe Kenji's album? That's that's what I want to know, bro. I want to see where like the um. The fandom is that what we're not looking for? The fans, the fans. I want to see where all y'all opinions stand versus my opinion. You know, so if y'all want like a post or something like that, then let me know in the comments, man. Uh, that would see my reason though. Where do I want to put that? I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put see my see my reason right above tightrope, and then right below used to know. Okay, the next song we got is Moving On. We almost done, man. We only got five more songs left. Damn. All right, let's get into this song. I like that. I like that little quick burst right there. Like it was like real quick. Like that shit like happened in like a split second, bro. But I, I like that shit. That right there. That, that hold on. Let me go back again. Right there. That trying to find. 
trying to find some space for you, but I don't got no room for love. I think that's what he said. I seen a I seen a tweet about this earlier today, bro. This springy with the thingy. I just seen this a tweet about that earlier. Did he? I don't know if he tweeted that today, or if somebody else tweeted it. I don't remember, man. But I just remember seeing a tweet about I said springy with the thingy or something. All right, that was moving on. Ooh. I put, damn. I was about to say, I put push to start all the way down here, bro. But then I just realized that all these damn songs that I got above push to start went dumb. I don't feel right playing moving on so low, man. I'm going to put moving on right below push to start and it's right above finders keepers. I don't feel right doing that, bro. But it's not like any of these songs are bad. I just, that just goes to show how good this nigga music is, man. But uh, the next song we got is Our Toxins. Fuck it. I hate being worried so much. Just want you beside me. Slime me. Treat me like a motherfucking side piece. Real nigga therapy. Fuck it. I take a blunt from my mind. A joint from my stress. Lost in space time. I don't know what's next. Quick hit. If I don't tell her, she might never stop licking. Yeah, yeah. If I don't tell her, she might never stop going wild. Bow to our toxins. Say me if you feel like you're doing something wrong. Bow to our Fuck it, baby. I'm going to do whatever I want. That song was cool. That song was cool. Hmm. I'm gonna put that song. I don't wanna. I'm gonna put that song right above "Need You" right now. That song was cool. As y'all can tell, well, I don't know if y'all can tell, but as y'all might be able to tell. I'm big on like flow harmonies type shit. Cause like I I feel like y'all can tell because the majority of the songs that I got at the top is my favorite are like singing, more singing type songs, you know. Harmony, flow, shit like that, bro. But like I don't know if y'all could really tell that or not. I just assume y'all could bro. but um our toxins had like this crazy little it not it wasn't crazy it was a cool little flow it wasn't that super crazy it was it was low key chill it just throw going through the motions it sounded like to me man but like um I'm gonna put that one at right right below uh needs you right now so yeah it's at number ten right now but the next song we got is autopilot autopilot I've heard that name like several, several times. I think I've seen a snippet for Autopilot on YouTube millions of times and I recommend it and I've never clicked on it because I like to try to keep uh I, I like to try to keep music fresh. I used to listen to Luke Leaks for Juice World, man, and then like 
he passed away, R.I.P. Juice World. And whenever his albums dropped, they were almost all – well, they weren't – yeah, they, they were almost all leaks, man. And I was kind of disappointed. I was like, I've heard this before, man. So, I was like, you know what? I'm not going to listen to leaks anymore. I don't listen to snippets either. I try not to. If I see a snippet, then so be it's just a snippet. It's not like I'm listening to league music. But uh, I wouldn't. I would not listen to league music no more, man. But we got autopilot, <clears throat> and this beat already starting off crazy. <clears throat> Are those synths? Synth? I don't know. I can. That's that's what it sound like, though, bro. A synth. Yeah, that's a, a synth. That sounded like fuck your feelings, Joe Kenji, right there. That's what that sounded like to me, man. Uh, where do I want to put that one? Autopilot. I'm going to put autopilot right below push to start, right above moving on. For our next song, we got not the half of it. And then after that, we're going to have more than ever. We only got two more songs, man. Damn. I wonder when Joe gonna drop another album. <laughs> Alright, but let's get into not the half of it. That was not the half of it. That was, that song was like our toxic. It was cool, you know. What do I want to put that? I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put that at eleven. It's gonna go right below our toxins and right above need you right now. All right. For the last song, we got more than ever. And once I once I'm done listening to more than ever, I'm gonna go back and listen to bottle for bottle and disaster and decide what I wanted one and what I wanted two. I meant what I wanted two and what I wanted three. Alright. More than alright. More than ever. Tell me that you love me forever and ever I've been painting pictures, I 
surprises. Wish we could paint them together. Starting to regret love more than never. More than never. Baby, don't you lose me for acting like you don't care about us. Baby, you my melody, my la la la. I've been painting pictures as you. Welcome to my fantasy world. It's nothing like reality where good hearts always die in the end. So the bad don't never have peace. So don't you ever let me go. Still on my mind, but couldn't never let you know. Still all these signs was pointed far away from home. But you're my home. Yeah, you're my home. Choose me or you'll lose me forever, cause I ain't waiting for you. Tell me that you'll love me forever and ever. I've been painting pictures, I just wish we could paint them together. Starting to regret love more than ever. More than ever. Tell me don't you lose me for acting like you. I don't know how, but I knew he was finna do that that at that ending. It just sounded like it fit well with the song. But uh more than ever. That was a cool song too. That was probably my favorite song out of the ones that I said are cool. So that one that one is gonna take number eleven. Um I'm finna re listen to Bottle for Bottle and Disaster right quick. And then I'ma have my full rankings. I will be back. Alright, I'm back. I just finished listening to Disaster. Midway through Disaster, I made my decision, man. But uh, I got Disaster over Bottle for Bottle. My final list is I got Prison in my head at number one, Disaster at number two, Bottle for Bottle at number three, Used to Know at number four, See My Reason at number five, Tightrope at number six, Vanish at number seven, Push to start at number eight. Autopilot at number nine. Moving on at 10. Finders Keepers at 11. More Than Ever at 12. Our Toxins at 13. Not the Half of It at 14. Needs You Right Now at 15. And as far as I'm concerned, like I said earlier, bro, Joe Kinsey is still not missed. None of these songs are bad. None of these songs are bad. Prison in My Head was a top tier Joe Kinsey song, in my opinion. That song was just too fucking good. Like, if I had to name my favorite Joe Kenji songs from like other albums, let me look, let me look. From Eat Your Heart Out, my favorite song from that album was For Life. For Life was just different to me, bro. That flow was fucking amazing. From Fuck Your Feelings, I don't even know, bro. It's either Hades or Porn Bitch or Lambo Truck. I don't know, bro. I gotta, I gotta uh, figure that out. Uh, from Race Me to Hell, It might be thumb through. It's either thumb through mixing or acting. It's one of those. And then from Tears and Pistols. It's either Hey or Sing Her a Song or Save Me. I don't know, bro. It's, 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 it's kind of hard to pick my favorite songs off those albums. I didn't I didn't discover Joe Kenzie till like midway, midway. Nah, not midway. It was it was by midway. It was about May 2021 when I discovered Joe Kenzie. So like those albums were like I was listening to like all of those albums all in one go, bro. So like it was just hectic, you know. I didn't think I don't think I'm gonna be able to pick a favorite song off of those. Except for Eat Your Heart Out. Off of Eat Your Heart Out. My favorite song off that album is most definitely For Life. That was like, when I had first heard that song, that shit was like different to me, bro. But, um, if y'all like my reaction, man, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know upload our next video. Uh, I appreciate y'all watching this video, man. If y'all made it through, if y'all made it all the way through the end, I appreciate y'all watching, man. Drop a... Uh, say say what your favorite song is in, off with or without you in the comments below, man. I appreciate y'all watching. Peace.